guys, okay, I did say I would come back and I would do a review on the Naked palette. So this is it, of course. At first I thought the material would be, well, we'll start off anyway. First, the, I thought the material would be just like any other palette, you know, like plastic. But this is actually felt on it, so it's nice and soft. So I'm sure it will get really dirty. I hope not, because I don't like my palettes getting really, really dirty, because I try and clean them off all the time. It comes with 12 different colours, from your lightest to your darkest. And there is lovely colours. There's a difference between, I think it's satin, velvet, and matte, and pigmented, sorry, not pigmented, um, shimmer. So yeah, this is virgin. This is thin, this is naked, this is sidecar, this one here is sidecar, this one is buck, this one's half baked, this one is smog, dark horse, toasted, a lovely colour, and hustle, creep, and gunmetal. So gunmetal is actually my favourite colour, which is what I've mostly been wearing since I've got this palette. They're all lovely. The two matte colours that I can see, well I think there is only two on them, is Naked and Buck, which are these two here, and they're lovely. Um, these are your two shimmery colours, well there's quite a few shimmery colours, but these two are shimmery. Um, this one shimmery and this one shimmery. And then the rest, I think, are all just satin. Right, in it, it comes with an uh, Urban Decay brush. And this brush is quite good. Well, I, in my opinion, it is quite good. So it is the shadow brush. It comes kind of, it's weighed out at the top and the bottom. So it's about the same weight. So I like that. I like the texture of, well, not the texture. I like the feel of these brushes, using them. So that is definitely what I'm going to invest in. I'm going to now invest in just some Urban Decay brushes because they're actually really good. I didn't think they would be, but yeah, they are really good, okay? Um, also, what came with it was a wee sample size of the primer potion, which is lovely, okay? And it comes just with like a wee, um, what would you call it, lip gloss, doodah thing, the applicator. Applicator, that's the word. <laughs> and it has it's skin tone so it is so that's good about it it comes with 3.7 milliliters in it so that's good i think okay so i'm going to do some maybe some swatches of the colors of my favorite colors well i know i'll do just do them all okay so this right here is gunmetal this is creep this is Hustle, I hope you can see that, it's like a purpley kind of colour, Toasted, so it's kind of a la light kind of shimmery colour on your finger, Dark Horse, I've never used Dark Horse before, but yeah, there's that there, and then we'll have um, Smog, Half Baked, lovely. Buck. So yes, Buck is matte. Sidecar is lovely again. Naked. Once again, that is matte. So you can't take the label, maybe not. Oh, you can. Okay, so I'm going to set the brushes down. And all you have left is virgin and thin. So I'm going to um, take these off my fingers and then show you virgin and thin. <coughs> which are two of my other favourite colours. Okay, so I love the, I think I love virgin more than thin, just in my particular liking. I don't know why, but I just think the colour is a lot nicer. So, oh, sorry, I got like makeup on the palette. This is virgin, so virgin is a lovely frosted colour, and thin is a lovely champagne-y frosted colour, frosted colour as well. So it is lovely. I love it. 
Um, the retail price is £35, which to be fair is quite dear for just 12 colours, which I thought at the time w is quite dear for just 12 colours and a brush and a bit of primer. But taking into consideration the level of pigmented, the level of how pigmented these colours are, it is so worth it. So yeah, um, I love it. It is brilliant. I just love it. And like, I think these colours will last quite a good time, good long time anyway. Um, I'm going to show you just a swatch of one random colour using the primer potion and one just without using the primer potion. Okay, so I'm just going to put a bit of the primer here and I'm just going to blend that in a bit. Okay, so I'm going to take, just on the wee shadow brush, I think I'll take Dark Horse. Okay, so I'm just going to take that on the shadow brush. And then just there. Okay, so. Okay, and you can just see automatically the difference. I mean, honestly, I'm just cleaning off the brush. Um, honestly, if you look, this is the one with the primer. It is so much more pigmented, and this one, it is still quite pigmented, but with the primer, it makes it a lot more pigmented. So I love that about it. Um, the Naked Palette, I've got to say, is now one of my favourite palettes. And I've been trying to get my hands on one since my birthday in May. That's when I got the Too Faced one. But in the end, I couldn't find the next. So that's why I bought the Too Faced instead. But I should have so waited until I went into Debenhams and Rushmere, which is in Craigavon, if you're from Northern Ireland or Ireland or anywhere. But yeah, it is in Craigavon. And I went in there, went into Debenhams just to have a look at the benefit stuff. And what do you know? there's your naked palette so yeah there it is there it is great i recommend if you love makeup a lot and you love your eyeshadows pigmented colors it is great i recommend that you do get it like i now see why everyone loves these so much and this color i mean all these colors would suit most skin no all skin tones some of the colors may not suit all skin tones but there is there's a big enough variety in this palette that will suit everyone so thank you so much for watching and please comment rate and subscribe oh and just one more thing uh, there was someone I'm so sorry I forget the YouTube your YouTube channel name but someone and um, got into contact with me about the eyelashes I wore in the giveaway video and these are them here they're just the Nicola Roberts ones by Eyler girls allowed and they're lovely I've just stuck them back on they're lovely with a nice slick out at the side of them so they're lovely I was only wearing them just to test them out the last day so yeah they're lovely and thank you so much for watching and keep watching because there'll be more videos coming up and there will be hopefully a lot more giveaways I've already started planning I'm doing a big like Christmas hamper giveaway so I'm really looking forward to that I'm going to do a couple of prizes like a, for a couple of people and I'm gonna do like give you some like a wee Christmas presents all for myself so I think I'm gonna do first second and third and yeah so I hope you guys enjoy and I'll see you in the next video bye oh and good luck to all of you in the um sorry good luck to all of you who entered my competition thank you so much for watching bye